Tonight's big story, the Maricopa County Attorney's Office is officially charging the man at the center of a violent arrest that was caught on camera. The charging decision comes as two Phoenix police officers are put on leave as the department investigates. Team 12's Chase Go Lightly has more on how all of this started and why the officers say they had to use physical force. Court documents we obtained today say both officers entered this quick trip gas station to use the bathroom. On their way out, they say the suspect tried to wave them down, but when that didn't work, police say he started firing. Ground, get on the ground. With guns drawn, you can see these two Phoenix police officers kick and hit 38 year old Harry Denman with their guns while he is on the ground. One of the kicks landing while he is handcuffed. According to this recently released probable cause statement, officers say they had to use physical force because Denman may have still been armed. Just moments earlier at this convenience store located on Buckeye Road and 59th Avenue, police say they were leaving when Denman tried to wave them down. The officers say they told him they had to go to another call. That's when they claim Denman pulled out a gun and fired two shots, one hitting the ground, the other, their cruiser. Denman ran into the store with officers after him. According to court records, a witness says Denman put a gun on the counter and stated that he shot at police to let them know he needed help. According to the records, after Denman was detained, the gun was recovered in the employee's only area, where Denman was contacted by officers. Chief Michael Sullivan, who was sworn in Friday, placed both officers on leave pending an investigation, saying in a statement, what is depicted in the video is not how we train and is not aligned with the core values of the Phoenix Police Department. Then Tuesday afternoon, the Maricopa County Attorney's Office officially charged Denman, including two counts of aggravated assault. Charges Denman has faced before and actually pleaded guilty to back in 2007. It was at that time Denman was accused of using a fake $50 bill at Fiesta Mall in Mesa. Records show an off-duty officer working security try to stop Denman when he pulled out a handgun pointed it at the officer and said, you think this is a game? Denman is currently being held on a $50,000 bond. The Phoenix Police Department telling me that additional information on this entire situation will be released next week. For now, we're in Phoenix. Chase Golightly, 12 News.